fucking do low key Ferg. Hey, today y'all, uh, we're gonna be breaking down simple, simple, simple. Look at the title time management. You thought I was gonna do all that extra editing shit? You was gonna make it time? No, use your imagination. <laughs> no, but look for real though. So, I'm gonna be breaking down 10 tips for time management, you know, and you know. I'm still working on these, so you know if I if if you can help me, like by telling you my secret, you can you know tell me some pointers and maybe it can help me. I I, don't, I ain't the best, but I'm better than where I used to be. I'm better than what I had originally planned out, mapped out for myself. So that's what that's what really what really counts. That's what really matters. So we gonna get right into it though. Prioritize the task. Make a list of tasks and priorities. Put these on uh, importance versus, you know, oh uh, this this gonna this gonna get done whenever. No, put it on like a a, a timer. Like when I say a timer, put it on like you know a quota. You want you want to hit this amount. You want to get this done by this time, give yourself a quota. And whatever you write down on that list, give yourself a quota to get that done. And it's going to help you, you know, with your taking, taking, make sure, you know, your time is, you know, used very um, healthily instead of uh, you are, you know, scrolling. And that, that, that means, you know, if you're just scrolling, you're not, you're wasting time. You could be monetizing. You could be monetizing. That's the opposite of scrolling, monetizing. Opposite of consuming, producing. I, I had to put that in y'all head. The second, the second for time management. Set goals. Make sure they realistic for yourself and work towards achieving them daily. When I say work towards achieving them daily, like it could be one small thing you do every single day. But it, it puts you, it's, it's slow motion. It's putting you forward, though. It's pulling you forward, though. Keep keep on, you know, keep doing that. Keep committed to that. Keep consistent of that. And and make sure, you know, it's realistic, too. Don't, don't, do not set a goal that's not meaningful to you. If your heart is not into that, that goal, if your soul is not into that, that you're not going to get it. Okay? You have to put your soul fully in it have to fully buckle down into it and that's when you you know finally you know get your goal like the goal that you always want to go you say you are always have goals right but you never get them done this is why because they don't mean shit you don't have no type of meaning for that goal you just you just you want something but you don't have no why you don't have a reason for it so find your reason Find your meaning, and you gon' and you gonna get that goal. Third on my motherfucking list. Look, create a schedule. Use a planner or calendar to schedule your days and allocate the time for each task. So for me, right, I got it like this: Moon Day, aka today, Music Day. Express my feelings, how I feel on topics, right? Mars Day, tomorrow, aka Tuesday. Passion Day, I write, I go freestyle aggressively, meaning like I go freestyle on some aggressive ass beats, like, like I have it all like mapped out. Wednesday, I I, I I'm booked on readings or somebody, you know, there I'm helping somebody in a real battle. Like, in a real life, not no fucking fake shit. Like, real life helping. Like, in perfect person. Not, like, you know, not doing shit. Like, Wednesday, that's that's the genuine day. That's, that's the day, you know, I do my community work, try to see if I can aid anybody who, who is, you know, in need. Thursday, I do that day to study. Like, I, I do way more studying than I, like, I study every day. It's not a time I don't study. But Thursday, that's the day like, I study the most. Like That's the day that I, I just... It's all about studying. And then no matter what I watch, I'm looking at it 
from how could I learn from this? I'm looking at it from how I, how they morals are. I look at it from ways on Thursday, on, on Jupiter Day, on ways for me to learn and expand my own wisdom from something, whatever, you know, I'm perceiving. And then, you know, <sighs> Friday, that's a pleasurable day. That's the day I either listen to all the music I made Monday or I just make, or I just like one take songs. Like I just go in there and I just sing my heart out, like, like, like I don't, I don't stop until, until like I'm about to throw up when I like, I'll be in the studio till I'm about to throw up or my voice gone. So that's what, that's what I be, you know, into. But you know, that's, that's like my little, you know, short little, like I'll tell you, it's not that much, but it's still, you know, something. It's like getting there, you know, I'm still young. I, I'm participating in more hobbies than I used to. And, you know, I'm putting myself more out there in p positions that, you know, I I wouldn't, you know, usually do when I was younger. I, I would stay in my comfort zone. But, you know, now I'm moving out of my shell. I'm moving to a place where, hey, the past is the past. Change is right in front of me. So that was that was two. No, actually, that was three. That was three. That was three. My bad. My bad. My bad. But four. Four. I got it. I got it. I got it on my notepads right here. Four. Avoid distractions. Try to minimize distractions such as social media, phone notifications, and unnecessary conversations. So listen, when people, when you have a conversation with people, if it's pointless, give yourself a, a 30, I wouldn't even, I wouldn't do that. Because every second matters. Get that in your hood. Every second matters. You're not going to get it back. Okay, so what I'm about to tell you, you know, you probably never heard nobody tell you that shit, but that's some real shit. So... Spending, wasting your time all on, on pointless conversation, pointless social media, pointless distractions. And you have a phone notifications, a.k.a. you just getting Twitter uh, tweets or you just getting Discord uh, notifications. This this will make you not be able to focus and, you know, you wasting time. You wasting seconds. You wasting energy on, on things that, you know... They wouldn't even be there if your D and D was on or your phone was just turned off, you know. And you, whatever you're working on, you fully work on that. And once you're done, see your phone as like a treat, like 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 a treat. Like when you're done with it, when you're done with your work, see your phone as like a treat, and make sure you uh you creatively invest yourself into into being productive. Okay. I, but yeah, you know, and give yourself thirty seconds with conversation. Say I'm done. Or say, or say <laughs> time's up. Say enough. Shit. Well, personally, though, you don't even gotta say shit. Just walk away. Personally, but if if you wanna be like, um, a person who could be, you know, I guess, for people and also for yourself. You could tell them, yeah, you know, I got to go. And, you know, you, I don't really like explaining shit to nobody. Barely, I barely be going deep. Like, I don't like explaining shit to nobody. If, if you get it, you get it. If you don't, you don't. But back to what I was saying. So, yeah, you know, just make sure if you have a conversation with somebody, it's leading somewhere. It's not just like y'all talking about eating ass. Y'all talking about Dumb shit, like shit that's straight pointless. Like now, if you into eating ass, like maybe you really about to eat they ass. But I'm talking about if you just like, yeah, I'm. Eat. You ate my like y'all just like saying that y'all eating ass, but y'all really don't eat ass. Y'all just like wasting each other like conversational time. I don't, I don't find that funny. So if you find that funny, you have problems. But look, five, right? So it's like this, right? Use time blocks. Group similar tasks together and work on them doing specific time blocks. So whenever you feeling like, you know, your time is being blocked, like you can't go nowhere and you with a group and they all working on a similar task together, make sure, you know, during that specific time block, you do the work that's necessary to complete that task with that person. So say like, you know, how... This, for example, so when you was in school, in science class, for instance, they would say, you know, this is your partner. And you had the smart partner. This is, look, you had the smart partner. So your partner, they going to do all, they did all the work. They they do all the work, right? When they do all the work, all you got to do is put your name on it. But look, 
So, back to the example. So, look. You just want to put your name on it. But since that person did all the work, they not going to let you put their name on it. They, hey, uh, shit. Me, personally, shit. They going to let me put my own kid. Oh, fuck what they talking about. But look, you, if you ain't like that, then, you know, they, they, they ain't going to let you put your name on there. So, you're going to have to, you know, you're going to either have to actually participate and do work. Or, you know, you're going, you're going, you know, going to get that F. So... What that mean is when it's a time where it's like a group of people, like y'all all together, and you see everybody else working, like they not on no distraction, not looking at all the other shit. They working. That's when you lock in, like I'm working too. And you know, put that work in like that whole time. Six, take breaks, take a short breakthrough out the day to recharge and avoid burnout so like say you i this is this is for instance this is example because like I'm, I'm putting myself out there because there's no this isn't about me say i i wake up at five in the morning okay i make songs for like you know it take it take me legit like two hours for each song but like like it's because i'll be going back and you know harmonizing it in the way that make me feel more like Comfort, comfortable with like releasing that, but you know that that's that's for that's for my musicians and all my people that like talking about music, all my mu- musical geniuses out there. You know that like y'all want to talk about musical genius, we could talk about that. I'm fucking person. I'm with that shit. I'm with I'm with talking for a try. I'm with all that shit. It's exciting. This shit drive me. I don't know what y'all. I don't know about y'all, but this is in my heart. I feel shit. I feel like I, I feel like I just got paid a million dollars, real like, real shit. I, and I don't even need the money. I just feel like I got paid, and that's all. That, that's all I cared about. I cared about having this feeling, right? And this feeling manifested. Hey, I'm right here. No, <laughs> I didn't get into it too, though. I gotta stay on track though. But yeah, take breaks. Take short breaks throughout the day to recharge. So I wake up, you know, make songs. Boom. When I'm done making songs. Boom. But, like, I meditate when I first wake up. I had to, I actually have to say that because I, I, I want y'all to know this is how I can do all of this. This isn't, it's not possible if I, never, I mean, this is possible. It's just way more sluggish. So, I meditate for about an hour in the a.m. And then, you know, I get up, make a song, dang, boom, finish the song, do the alloys, boom, dang, finish that, boom. I go, I go, I go, uh, Hop in the shower. Like, oh, actually, go take a shit. I don't know if y'all wanted to know that, but I guess we getting, we getting, we getting intimate. But getting like meaning intimate by we, you know, getting personal and you know, real close with each other and genuine and transparent. But so I get in, I got it. After that, I get in the shower. I brush my teeth in the shower. Don't ask me. I think it saves time. And you know. I wash my face when I, you know, I'm done with my brushing my teeth and like my body. So I do that. <sighs> then boom, I get out, put my shit on. Boom, I go, I go back to um, working on videos. I go back to writing. I go back to you know, um, editing. And then you know, I do that for like you know until it's like twelve o'clock. And when it's twelve o'clock. I I legit eat. I I go and eat. I, I I go and eat. And when I go and eat, I eat something that's not gonna make me sleepy. Cause if you overeat yourself, you can make yourself sleepy. So what I do is I get like a little fruit or some shit like some. Or sometimes I just get water. Cause sometimes I be going to the studio without drinking water before. But lately I've been you know. Like really, like with the new the new schedule I've been doing is I wake up, I meditate, then I go set I put my tea in the microwave. Like I make some tea from the microwave, then I let it get five minutes for five minutes. Then I put my herb like I got I got a um, natural herbal tea because like um I got locked in with a herbalist and you know she was giving me some herbs for you know purifying blood, but um that's a whole different topic I, I don't even. Y'all don't care about that. Y'all ain't come here for all of that. But, yeah, basically, you know, so that's what I do. And then, you know, after, like, the 12, after the little lunch break, I give myself, like, a 30-minute little, uh, you know, meditation session telling myself, you know, like, being, like, a 
a self-inspired motivator. Like, I'm my motivator. I'm my guru. Like, I'm all of that shit for myself. And then when I when I finally you know you know get ready, that's when I go back out. And then you know I, I do make another song, cause I make a song in the morning, make a song in the e- evening, then I make a song at nighttime. So I make another song, and then I go I go record like some videos, and then I go I go edit them, and then I go edit the songs that I just did, and then it it, it be like five o'clock. So when it's like five o'clock, I either lay down. Or I, I uh, you know, will uh, go watch like some other like you know astrologers or um, a person who is standing on business. Like if you standing on business, I'm probably fucking with you heavy. But if you not, I don't know about you at all. You nah, you don't exist to me at all. But yeah, you know. So basically, I, I take like two breaks throughout the whole day. And it's good to take breaks because this will make you feel it's like you never like getting tired. So that's why it's good to take a break. Because <laughs> you can avoid uh, burnouts. All right. If possible, delegate tasks to others to free up your time. Delegate tasks if possible. I mean, if you have a task to complete, make sure that you know, ask for help. If you have somebody around you, if they willing to give you assistance, you might as well take it. Because if, if you if you worry about if somebody going to ever come and you won't say, hey, let me help you. That ain't, ain't going to happen, I'll be honest. That ain't going to happen. Closed mouths do not get fed. Okay? So if you need help, for you to free up some of your time, you need to, you know, you need to uh, delegate your tasks, meaning share it. Share it with some people who wants to, you know, be a part of what you got going on. And eight, learn to say no. Don't take on more than you can handle. Learn to say no when necessary. Like, you don't have to, you know, get burdens from people, who, like, you know, do things for people when you don't want to. Say no. And be firm with it too. Be you be a little ugly too. So next time they ask you, they double think about it too. That they like, should I ask this? Should, should I ask this question? You know, make sure they make sure that they like. I don't know if I should ask that. Last time I asked that shit, you know, when they said, I know they said no, but they that no made me don't even want to ask another person. So like, you know, say no. Learn to say no. You don't got to be no. Yes. Yes. And 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 they sound and and and, and they sounding like they uh they making fucking <laughs> they they sound like like say they making a song right, but they sound just like a fucking trash like they just make loud noise, so and and, and then they get paid to do that shit so you know they got a bunch of yes men yeah that shit was fire man, and, and the whole time they all got earbuds ear. Those little deaf little earbuds, like the things you put in your ear to, to block out noise. Earbuds, they put that shit in their ear. But nine, focus on task at time. Avoid multitasking and focusing on one task. Focusing on fucking on <laughs> focusing on one task at a time. Increase productivity. So if you're gonna make like, look, I'm just using this for example. If you're gonna make music, make make get the beat, put the beat in the software, or if you if you if you a producer. Create the beat, like just create the beat. That whole that's the like if you were, create the beat that whole day, like that day is just going to just the beat, and then the next day add, add just just the rapping, then the next day add just the mix and master, and you know that 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 gonna help you you know get more um, productive in your uh, your perception. So you know this is about time managing. You know so it it's going uh cuz of you thinking multitasking you really get you further but what it really does is make you half work it make you half effort every fucking thing you do so you need to put put in perspective what you have to do one thing only and when you do that one thing into it's fucking you know so fucking good at it then that's when you can be able to you know do another thing multitask but if you're trying to mo- focus on multitasking instead of focus on one task then you're gonna, you know, feel less lazy and overwhelmed, and you're gonna get burnt out quicker. 
So, and lastly, 10 for everybody. For everybody. Review and adjust regularly. Review your schedule. Meaning, if this the day you're going to do it, that's the day you're going to do it. Reschedule. Make sure that, you know, this the day this this the day you're going to do it. Or, you know, if it's not the day this you're going to do it, adjust it to as to, as to what is needed for you to ensure that you're going to make most of your time you there. So, with time management for everybody, just just avoid avoid distractions. I, I gave y'all a whole blueprint blueprint. I gave y'all a whole blueprint. Uh, I, if I don't say the words right, y'all still know what I mean though. Like it's a space that that I'm be pointing to when I speak about it. So it's just like for you to have better time management, you gotta how you gotta really understand, really understand, really overstand how much time is valuable because time you can't get it back that second the whole time you recording this i cannot get it back only way i can see it only way i can see it back is because i recorded it if i did not i would not be able to get this time back i want y'all to get that in y'all head though peace